It's too late to save your fellow Seeker. Stand aside, or you die too! No, you've got it all wrong! If Gato's a Seeker, then that would make this a Seeker problem, wouldn't it? And, well, can't we at least try and resolve this without anyone dying? Let's start from the beginning. What exactly happened here? To answer that, we must indeed start from the very beginning. We found Gadel many years ago when he was just a babe. He'd been kidnapped by giants who attacked his home, so we took him in. Though we raised him as one of our own, he lacked the blood of a warrior, and as such, it was impossible for him to become one. So instead, Gadel worked hard, helping in every way he could, until the giants attacked. Where do we go? They surrounded the village! All the fighters! Sir, you've saved us all. Not from around here. Who is he? He's a seeker. He has to be. I've never seen one before. <laughs> well, that was close. Glad I was passing by. I'm Gato. What's your name, sir? Who, me? It's Yamanaka. Yamanaka the Seeker. You know, I think I'll stick around for a little while, if you'll have me. Yamanaka was a stranger from the outside world, but also a profoundly strong warrior and Gadol idolized him. Over time, Yamanaka became a friend and mentor to the boy. I see. Is that how Gadol changed? Yamanaka trained him to become a warrior? Oh no. Gadol's transformation is still a mystery. One day they were in the village, and the next they had disappeared. We assumed Yamanaka had taken Gadol with him on his journey as an apprentice. It made the most sense at the time. But just as we'd given up our search, the boy returned. <laughs> to the gates! <laughs> You're not a giant, so who are you? What? Don't you recognize me? Everyone, it's me! It's Gato! Huh? Isn't it great? I'm a seeker now! Mr. Yamanaka made me one! Look! He turned me into a powerful warrior! And so Yamanaka didn't return to the village with Gato? He hasn't been seen since he left. Gator said he used some peculiar magic to make him a seeker, then disappeared soon after. Peculiar magic? That sounds like he did something with debug mode. Not long after his return, it was as if Gator unleashed years of frustration, hunting down any and all giants he could. The giants were no match for his strength, but the same was true of our village fighters. Here comes the finishing blow! In his recklessness, he has killed both friend and foe. He's a rampaging beast, thoughtlessly trampling anyone unlucky enough to get in his way. We don't want him dead, but we can't go on like this! So this is because Gadel has been accidentally hurting people. But once wounded pride entered the mix, everything spiraled out of control. We have to kill him before he kills us! Let's go! <laughs> Hold on, please! <sighs> Give me a little time. This can't be the answer. That's about the size of it, so what now? We let them kill Gadol or do it ourselves. Huh? We should kill Yamanaka too. It's the easiest way to fix things. You can't. You're all seekers. Can't you work together to find a solution? Hopefully, yes. Come on, Akira. Let's do this peacefully. What? But why, though? Because, well, because we just can't go around killing people, that's why. Akira's keeping it simple. Eliminate all anomalies, no exceptions. We go around Haga monsters, can't think outside the box of finding and people. fixing every bug. Well, maybe we and Nicola sees herself it. in Gadel. Ah, screw it. Screw it. Haga, making this our fight only distracts from our goal. Let's get back to the main quest. Yeah, but we can't leave now, not when... <laughs> huh. Well, we're too late. W wait, what does that mean? I can hear the villagers fighting. Seems they couldn't wait for your peaceful solution anymore. Joseph! Paul! Joseph! They don't understand! They just wanted to be a warrior! Why were you so mean to me?! Why is it such a bad thing that I can finally fight beside you?! Why can't I be a warrior? Because I'm an orphan? Why does that matter?! All I wanted was to help everyone! Why I became so strong?! They just... I just wanted to protect the village the same way it protected me! That settles it. Definitely killing him. Kira, no! We need to find Yamanaka first! It's too dangerous to go after him without knowing what Yamanaka did! And Gadel's not that subtle. It won't be hard to follow him and see where he goes. You... 
Mr. Yamanaka, I need your help. And that about does it. Oh, hey, Gadel. How's it going? <laughs> Were you using seeker magic just now, Mr. Yamanaka? Sorta. There was something I had to look into. Are you here because you were getting bullied again? <laughs> it's nobody's fault but mine for being so weak. I wish I could be the kind of warrior you are so I wouldn't deserve it so much. Hey, I know firsthand that no one ever deserves to get bullied. What? You got bullied too? I see. Then I definitely have to get strong like you. That way I can get them all back for what they've done to me. That's not what I said, and that's not how it works. The strong have a responsibility to protect people. You have to do better than those who hurt you. <laughs> then I promise, if I ever get strong, I'm not gonna bully the weak or anyone, ever! I'll protect them, like you!